Hi, I'm Stuart Preston with My Business Advisors and this is the My Business Minute. Today's topic is tracking your marketing ROI. You need to have a system that tracks your marketing so you know what's working and what's not working. Your ROI is your sales divided by the cost of that marketing activity. So you can take any marketing source, go back, track all the, in all the income and the revenue you got from that, divide it by the cost, and that's your return on your investment for that marketing source. What you also want to do is go back and track the number of customers or clients you got from that. Because you can take the cost of that activity, divide it by that number, and now you know for each marketing source what it costs you to get a new customer. So I want you to track it constantly, analyze it quarterly, make small adjustments, and you'll eventually turn your marketing plan into a science. In case in point, I asked a client of mine once to track this, and he said this would be a waste of time. He already knows where all of his marketing, where all of his business is coming from. And I said, okay, just do it for one or two months, and let's see what happens. Well, after a couple of months, we sat down, we looked at it, and he was very surprised at the results. So over time now, we've actually gone back, made the adjustments we're talking about, and now his marketing plan gets a much higher ROI overall. Then you can do that too. So your launch point this week, your action point, is to go back and gather your data. Go back three to six months, get your revenue that is associated with each one of your marketing activities and the number of clients that you got per marketing activity. Then you can do the calculations. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Stuart, you told me these formulas and all this math and I don't remember what's going on. Just go to the website if you're not here already, mybusiness-advisors.com. Right below the video is a downloadable form that has all the information that you need to get started on this. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you next week when we're gonna be talking about how you should become the best in your market.